going on guys look today we got a Tex-Mex style smoked pepper let's do it <laughs> ain't these after school peppers so look to make these things we just got a few ingredients we got the bell peppers we've already trimmed them and got all the the guts out of them look when I'm buying these things I like to do the female peppers they got the four bumps on the bottom so they stand up better you get the male peppers with the three bumps they'll fall over but anyway We've already browned our hamburger meat. This is a pound and a half of hamburger meat with one whole onion with your favorite taco seasoning, just one pack. And to that, we're going to add in one can of black beans, one can of corn, strained everything. We're just going to add it in our mixture. To that, we got some pre-cooked Spanish rice. You don't have to microwave it, do none of that. We're just going to put it on in there like that. I got a cup and a half of cheese. Use whatever cheese you like. This is just a queso blend we got out of a bag. After that, we got one can of enchilada sauce. So we're going to give this a good mix. Just make sure everything's well incorporated. All right, so now that we got everything mixed really well, we're just going to start stuffing these peppers. Look, i got four peppers here. It may not all fit, but, you know, we'll do something else with it later if it don't. So I'm not going to pack them to the brim because I'm going to add some more cheese later on. And it's going to expand a little bit. I don't want them blowing the peppers out. Look, I don't parboil the peppers. I know a lot of people, they do. I don't. I'm going to show you what I do. It just saves a step in the kitchen. Making a little bit of a mess. That's why we cook outside. We can make a little bit of a mess. Yeah, we're almost done here. Kind of clean the sides up in this pot. But if you don't, no big deal. It'll be fine. So we got some chicken broth here. Look, we're gonna add some to the bottom. This is what's gonna steam them peppers and get them real soft. That way you don't have to boil the daggum peppers. Just save the step. And look, I don't I don't fill the pan up. I put about a cup, cup and a half, something like that. Look, we got the pit boss preheated to 325. We got to go over to the grill. So anyway, we got the pit boss preheated 325. It's gonna fluctuate a little bit, but these are some smoked peppers. So I'm about to light that smoke tube up. Oh yeah, here it is. Look, make sure when you like these smoke tubes, you get on them really good, because they will go out. You want to make sure you got enough coals so that thing smokes the whole cook. Yeah, just like that. Look, the only thing left to do now is put these things on here. We'll give these things about 45 minutes, and then we'll come back, check them out, and if they're ready, we're going to add some cheese, and then we'll be done with this thing. So it's been a little over 45 minutes. Let's check these peppers. Oh yeah, they're looking good. They're starting to soften up. I'm gonna say these need about 30 more minutes, but while we got this lid open, we're gonna go ahead and put some cheese on them. This is where I would not be shy with the cheese. As you can see, we still got some liquid in the bottom. So we're going to give these things another 30 minutes, and then we're going to come back. I guarantee you they'll be ready to be pulled. So it's been an hour and a half now. Let's check these peppers. Oh, man, that's what you want to see with these Tex-Mex peppers. Hey, look, if you like what we're doing right now, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Look at it down below. It's free to do. It helps the channel grow. But anyway, we're going to get these things pulled, get them on the cutting board, and give them a try. All right, so these peppers are off the pellet grill. The only thing left to do now is give it a try. But I'm telling you, these things are tender. Woo. I'm trying to figure out a way to get this thing out of here. Here we go. Let's see how we're going to try it. Ooh, 
man. Right there. I'm gonna get us a little, a little cheesy piece. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, get off that daggum tomato paste pepper and get on these Tex-Mex peppers. Hey, <clears throat> thank y'all for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Help the channel grow. Till next time.